welcome to Norris Cove. I'm Yoshida. Today is Cash Stuffing Saturday. So if that is something that you'll be interested in, stay tuned. Okay, you guys. <laughs> so excited i have more of the stuff this week i didn't even i'm so used to my same categories i didn't really know what i was going to stuff i should have went by this um as usual we're not stuffing um these envelopes so i'm gonna tell you why i got um products this week already on my regular account i got gas this week um i need eating out but i have that money already here since i'm gonna use it like today um, and tomorrow so that money's there um, gifts all that stuff I'm doing this week okay so let's hop on into it we should be stuffing um, $138 y'all this week was really good so I'm glad that I have more stuff it makes up for those you know weeks when I don't I did take out of my envelopes this week only because at the beginning of the week things were kind of slow and it seemed like my bills hit like that the beginning of the week so Let's count. I hate that my money is always backwards, but anyway, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, and 38. So we have $138. I haven't been able to stuff this much in a good little while, but <clears throat> this week was excellent, and it really was like, it didn't, it got good like yesterday, which was Friday, and today. The beginning of the week was a little slow, so sometimes I have to go into my envelopes, but I'm trying to like replenish them, and as I showed you in my wallet, I have money there. I have almost 200 here, but to... Monday is my hubby's birthday, so we're taking them out today. So I figured dinner is going to be around 100. And then tomorrow, <clears throat> my salon, we're going out for um, our little salon outing. I mentioned that in my plan with me. And so um, I already bought my tickets for that. I had to get tickets. We're doing candles. And then um, we're going to eat afterwards. So let's add this up. I'm going to do a quick review of last week. Um, I do that in my uh, weekly, you know, paycheck. But anywho, last week we put in um, a total of $108. Money out was $270, you know, from the week before. And then we had a total of $156. So this week, let's... Um, I don't think I need my calculator right now. We're going to start with our high priority. And that is this binder here for me. Um, we're going to start, I need to be doing that for real, but we're going to start with, um, our $1 challenge. Oh, I need to add that. I put 38, so I actually took out $40 this week. I'll just cross that out. I didn't see that one. So I took $2 out of here. So we're going to be putting five in here. One, two, three, four, five. Putting that back into our $1 challenge. This is going, this is like the only challenge that I can do, you guys. I'm sorry. It's just like only one I can really focus on. I'm going to try some other ones later when I get the hang of stuff in envelopes and can stick with it. Next, we go to our emergency fund. And here I made a note that I took $20 out. So I'm putting, giving it 40. That's 20, 30, and 40. And let's see how much we have in here. And I was so close to 200 before, so I'm trying to catch up. So now in the emergency fund, we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 5, and 10, 110. So we have 110 in the emergency fund. We're building it back up. Okay, now other things, some may be high priority, some may be low, but they're actually like medium to low in this binder here. So the first thing we're going to be stuffing, we're not doing nail supplies, like I don't really need anything. I'm not doing other people right now, so I haven't been stuffing that, but household because I need like laundry detergent, um, just some other small things. So we're giving that 15, 10, and 5. So we have 15 in laundry, I mean laundry, 
15 in household. Okay, next up, we're skipping business supplies. Okay, why are we at business supplies? So, if you haven't heard, I'm launching the budget box. It'll be a monthly subscription or one-time um, purchase. And I had $18 in here. I built that up, you know, over the few months. And I had this in mind, but along with something else, which I am still may do the something else, but uh, mainly the budget box. So, I took $18 out. So, I'm not um, funding that this week because, um, like, I've already like started paying for stuff and paying out of my pocket, out of my bank account. And so I'm just not stuffing that right now. I don't need to because we're doing the budget box. So all the money that I'm getting from the sale of the box is just going back into the box. Like there's really right now no profit and I'm okay with that. So next up will be vacation. Let's get them Bentley. Bentley's good. Vacation is getting five. And I almost like didn't fund this because I just don't foresee one in my future. But, you know, you never know. And I guess if I build it up and focus on it, you know, it'll grow. So I'm going to put five in vacation. Next up is Hubby. I have Gerald. He gets 35, so he's going to get 10. 35 for Gerald. And my goal for this envelope, if you're new here, this is my husband. I don't pay any bills. Um... He don't really get on me about it, but I just feel like I could take some pressure off of him if I could just chip in a little bit. So um, that's what I'm trying to do. So I want to each week give him something. My goal is 50 a week, but um, we're starting kind of small now. And then at the end of the month, even if it's $100, here, here you go. 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, and 70. And like, you know, his birthday is this weekend. So even if, you know, he won't take it, I could actually use it um, for that. So what did I say? 40, 50, 60, 70. So, Gerald has 70, you guys. So, I hope I can get at least another 30 or 50 before the first. So, Gerald has 70. And I'm, I didn't touch his envelope. <laughs> I didn't touch his envelope. Boo front. I did take five out of it. You know what? Let me just wipe this out because clearly... This is another five on top of the 40. I thought I took out something else. So that's $45. Let me make a note to the side here. I put 38, so we have 45. So I can add that up later. Okay. Wait a minute, did I add the five to the booth rank? No, yes, she did add the five. Um, booth rank is five. Y'all pardon me. I, I sometimes just can't focus, okay? So, booth rent has five. And we're done with this binder. We're going to move on uh, to the next binder, which is my Falifax wallet. Anyway. And we're going to skip to week ahead. That's this envelope right here. It gets 15. I did take some money out of that a few weeks ago. So I'm trying to build that back up. So that gets 15. Oh, y'all, wait a minute. I got to back up. Um, booth rent. Oh, let me add this up. What I got in week ahead. Slow down. Yesterday. So now we have 20 in week ahead. I have to back up to booth rent. Booth rent is ten dollars, so I gotta go add a five into that. Moving to phase, moving to phase. So booth rent has ten dollars. I don't know how I made that mistake. All right, let me update this. Let me just get out that old white out here. So booth rent has 10. Okay. All right. So after week ahead, y'all, I need tires. I got my oil change this week. That was another thing. I had to get my oil change. Um, I need tires, they said. So I think this I should be at an eight. I'm at a four. So that means like they're pretty much bought. <laughs> so they're getting five dollars for car maintenance. I'm gonna hopefully build that up. 
I really haven't bought, I don't even know if I've ever bought tires for that truck, but I need to check on them and price them so I'll know what this goal will be. But right now, I just wanted to start it off with five. Next up is planning. I'm giving planning five. Because I still want to go to go wow, but then um, I'm trying to kind of narrow down some of my inserts for 2023. I normally wait to December, so I pretty much got time for this. And then for birthdays, it's going to get three. And even though, like, my daughter's birthday is coming up next after my husband's birthday, my mother's birthday is next. And, like, I could use this to get her a card. Um... I was going to take this out since I'm going out for my husband's birthday, but I said since I have a nice amount set aside for him, um, I'm going to um, like pretty much save this for my mother's, and she's having a 70th birthday party next year, not this year, so that was one of my main reasons for making a birthday um, envelope. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, six dollars in birthdays. I'm going to put some slits in so I can just rip this out. And I want to make me some more envelopes like this. Yeah, hold on, y'all. Let's just take this out. Make it easier on myself. Okay, well, let me find some scissors. And I'm going to slit this so... Just take this out a little easier. Okay, boom. There. Yeah. So we are six dollars in birthday. So that is all the binders. And I said I wanted to do like a hundred at least this week. So let's get our calculator. I'm gonna use the white calculator to fit. And let's add everything up. So over here, we have 110. And we have 136 in these envelopes over here. And then here we said we have $45 in money that went out of these envelopes from last week. And money in was 138. Source would be hair. So sinking funds. Uh 40 it was 138. And that's 38. Oh, no, that's our total. I'm sorry. 136 plus 110. That leaves us with 246. Total. Okay, quick review. Let me put this out the way. Let's put this up. Okay, quick review. We have 110 in our emergency fund. We don't count the fives. So we had 110 in our high priority sinking funds. And we put $93 into our medium to low sinking funds. And we had a total of 136. Um, we took $45 out this week. And I put down TBB, which is the budget box, and bills. And um, money in was $138. And that was for my hair. And um, yeah, so our total single funds was 246. So again, I will have this listed below. Um, also listed below will be all about the budget box. The link will take you right to the budget box. Um, all the inserts, the budget inserts that I use, they are on my website. You can just click the link below. I hope today that you enjoyed today's video. And I pray that you will hit that subscribe button. Also hit that notification bell. Also, if you enjoyed today's video and you would love to see more, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!